Symplectic Elements is the research information management system that Imperial College London researchers use to manage and link their publications, grants, professional activities, projects, and equipment. This video outlines how to edit your personal profile. To get the most out of your Symplectic profile, you will need to personalize your settings. Begin by logging into Symplectic using your Imperial College login details. If you are unable to log in for any reason, contact ICT or the relevant faculty digital communications contact. After logging in, you will be taken to your home screen, which is divided into several sections. The workspace, inbox, and account settings are located at the top with section tabs below that. There are also individual entity boxes that detail actions you can take relating to your publications, activities, navigation bar, and so on. One of these boxes is My Data Sources. Here you can select which databases you would like Symplectic to search for your publications. By clicking on this box, you can choose subject areas or keywords for each database in the advanced mode by clicking on the Expand button next to a database or you can use the default search terms in the simple mode. We recommend selecting the maximum number of relevant databases and using the default search terms in order for Symplectic to capture as many of your publications as possible. Once your data sources and search settings have been set up, Symplectic will begin searching for your publications. You can also link your ORCID identifier to your Symplectic profile. Most Imperial faculty members will already have one, though if you do not yet have an ORCID identifier, you can easily sign up for one at orchid.org. In addition to changing your data sources, you can also edit your default search terms in My Search Settings on your home screen. Clicking on My Search Settings will show you the status of your selected data sources and when Symplectic last ran a search. Below the status box is where you can edit your personal information. We recommend that you add in all names under which you publish. Examples include initials, hyphenated surnames, anglicized non-English names, and so on. Once you have turned on and edited your search settings, you will receive an email from Symplectic whenever a new publication has been found for you to claim or reject. These publications will also be in the Pending Publications section under My Actions. To reject a publication, click the red X. To claim a publication, simply click the green check. If you claim them, these publications will appear in your list of publications, both in Symplectic and your PWP after it has synced. You will also be notified of publications that are awaiting deposit after you have claimed them. All Imperial authors are encouraged to deposit their research outputs in Spiral in order to be eligible for the next REF. You can also create a manual record to apply for open access funds. The video, Guide for Depositing an Accepted Article in Symplectic, can be found at www.imperial.ac.uk slash open access. Please note that you can only apply for open access funds by creating a new manual record and you must upload your accepted manuscript. If you have any questions about setting up your Symplectic profile, please contact the relevant faculty digital communications person for further assistance. If you have any questions about open access, please contact the open access team at openaccess at imperial.ac.uk.